5G gives you an opportunity to monetize the network differently as opposed to 3G and 4G. You know, we went from charging voice and text and data to basically living in a world of unlimited. 5G allows us the opportunity to basically charge for services and charge differently. Whether it be e-health, whether it be autonomous car services, whether it be network slicing for mission critical services, I think 5G gives us a new opportunity to reset the bar here. So if you think about ultra fast, highly reliable, low latency communications, one of the primary use cases that comes to mind is the world of VR and AR. When you think about 5G and the capabilities, once you add mobile edge computing and you move this computing power to the edge of the network, you suddenly have the opportunity to provide a consumer with a great headset, low cost, they don't have to have the computing power in their house, they can use it from the network. And this makes a very, very compelling event for VR and AR. It could be the tipping point that we've all been waiting for in the industry. There is a change when it comes to 5G in the way we can basically monetize the assets that a service provider has. Now you can start charging for network slices, you can start charging for different application services, you can start looking at how you monetize APIs that you sell in a wholesale manner. So I think 5G also allows you to look at the network and the service layer a little bit differently and monetize and charge for it more creatively than we did before.